Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are opening the board game Apiary designed by Connie Vogelman and art by, I'm going to butcher it, Kawanshi Moria. Uh, this is the first printing, very high number, but yeah, by Stonemeyer Games, 1 to 5 players, 60 to 90 minutes. And yeah, here with my fiance. Hello. And we're going to open this game, I guess. It's about bees that have taken over the earth. They're like car-sized bees or something. It's been a little bit since I read this, but then it might be hard to see. I guess I can just mess everything up and bring the camera up. And if y'all want to stop and read any of this, you can. Sorry about the glare from the lights. Okay. But yeah, let's get this open and check out what all is inside. And we'll go from there. It's funny as at first I thought the box was dirty and then I realized that it was just the design. Space bees. Space bees. Space box. Ooh, My favorite part, take it off the plastic. Mm -hmm. So satisfying. I was just thinking I'll suck at it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow, that's even funnier. Take the lid off. Lots of stuff. So much stuff. Oh my god, so many things to punch out. So I'll grab papers here. Looks like we have the probably rules book. And then an appendix. And then the solo Automa book. And then there is a teaching guide, double sided. Oh, nice. Just learn how to play it, looks like, from the beginning. We won't go through all the stuff, we'll just show off stuff. Oh, okay. Well, over here we have a first punch out board. Flip it over. Oh. Ooh. And the backs are really pretty. Wish we had a better setup to go further out, but this is what we got. But there's a lot of a lot of punch boards in here, not super thick, empty, but a bunch of different spaces and whatnot. Hmm. Oh, we could do some fermentating. But all the different planets. Should have read on the back. Do you want to show those off and I'll read this overview out while uh, you're showing those? That sounds great. It says, in Apiary, each player controls one of 20 unique factions. So there's 20 factions to play as, so that's a lot. Your faction starts the game with meager supplies, a hive, a few resources, and worker bees. A worker placement hive building challenge awaits you. Explore planets, gather resources, develop technologies. Oh, I thought something was missing out of that punch board that distracted me. Uh, and create carvings to demonstrate your faction's strength, measured in victory points. Over a year's flow, however, the Darth quickly approaches, and your workers can only take a few actions before they must hibernate. Can you thrive or merely survive? That is the game. And then you have all the different hive tiles and worker placement spots and... All the different factions yeah because yeah, you start off okay. with your your basic little hive so that's your, your starting hives and the different factions that you can choose from I like that there's 20 it's gonna have a lot of replayability right which is always great along with, with all these different combinations of like the hives you can build and tiles you can get and stuff Right, and you can be an architect, or a botanist, a deputy, a biochemist, neat. And these are super advanced space bees. Super advanced space bees. A wayfinder, everybody needs one of those. Cool. Do, do, do. All right. And looks like we have like the player mats, maybe, or some kind of missions. Not sure. 
The Langstroth. The Langstroth. With end game goals. The log. The log. The Popel Popleton. 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 Where? Oh, there's oh. ships. And then the skip. I'm sure these are probably for the solo game, maybe. And that's the the solo enemies. Um, hive, essentially. It's mm -hmm. probably probably really what it is. Got this nice little cardboard to divide and keep all our pieces safe. Mm -hmm. And then we have the giant board. Oh my god! I don't know if we can unfold it on here. Looks like it's like a six fold. Oof. Um, scoot this over, and I'll try to fold it out, but make it kind of the background. Of, and it is double sided, so that is kind of cool as well. Oh wow! So I'm guessing there's one. Side. I don't. Know. I'm guessing there's one side for maybe two to three players or something, or one side for the solo side. I'm not sure. But there was that side, and we're gonna flip back to this side. And then we'll just open the rest of the game on the board. Okay. Hmm. Looks like we have uh, probably a player guide. What is that, the little key? Mm -hmm. There's multiples of these. I'm gonna guess five. Probably. And then some tiles. That in game. But there's a lot of those. Oh, they're just cards. Like in game scoring cards, it looks like, that are the highest shape. Our resources, got the water. Let's see. Looks like this is wax. Very nice, very pretty. Water. Fiber that looks like seaweed. Or maybe it's caterpillars. It's the, the player guide key card thing says fiber. <laughs> basic resource cubes. Mmm. Gotta love that pollen. It'll really punch you in the face. And. Honeys. Mm -mm -mm. Ooh. Alright. Yeah, the best part. What is next? Oh, the bees. The bees. Grab some of them out of here. But they're all rotate for their power, I believe. So whatever is facing up is what the power of this bee is. And then once they hit past one, don't they have to go hibernate? I don't know. Uh, maybe. maybe. I don't remember. It's but, been a minute. <laughs> yeah. It looks like they were all like washed in a dark wash. They're very nice. And then there's also the big bee. <gasps> the big bee. I think this is the first player marker, if I remember right. It does have a little stand that goes in it. Mm, probably. It's so but, cute. Yeah. Might wind up painting that eventually. A lot on my painting plate right now. We've got extra baggies because oh, nice, they're nice. thoughtful. And do, 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 this beautiful deck of cards. Oh, in this part, the tray comes out. Nothing That's in the bottom nice of the box. Some nice plastic. Oh, it was smart. I put a pull tab, and then I broke it. Do this. All right, I got it. I got it. Sorry. 
I'm having some technical difficulties with my hands here. Right? I'm telling you. Oh, wow. Alright, so it looks like maybe we have, like, action cards. Dirt, resource, advance, research, grow, explore. Alright. Gain the resources shown on any explored planet. So then I'm guessing this is just, this is the deck. Oh, it's a cute little symbol. Gain some, gain some wax, gain some energy, pollen. Anyways, it looks like all the pictures are the same on here. At least down here. Seed and then, cards. oh, s seed cards. That would make sense as to why they're little crystal seed things. <laughs> um... And looks like they score you some in-game points. And the big B was the queen ship. Oh, the queen ship. Do, 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 do. I guess that's everything. And that is everything. So yeah, uh, that's everything for this unboxing. So if you liked what you've seen, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, ring the bell to keep up to date with my latest videos. And as always, have a great day. Yeah.